Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Gemini, August 28, 2024. Pacing yourself can be the key to success today, but it's also important to stretch your mind and open yourself to new possibilities. Transit support a creative approach to work and money matters. You're also in great shape for intimacy and repairing relationship woes or coming to a better understanding of your relationship situation. Attracting resources from outside sources comes more easily. It's an excellent time to work out money problems or other issues of sharing with a partner. Agreements about money, power, and sharing can be a strong theme. Venus harmonizes with Pallas and heads into a beautiful aspect with Uranus, your ruler, and you're in great shape for healing and a better understanding of your feelings and affections. A recent shift may be especially noticeable now. Ceres, an asteroid in the depths of space, has been moving forward into deep corners of your sky the peaks of Capricorn. This will help you to focus on how you approach self-care, self-love, and nourishment of who you are. However, you are also assessing how your important unions and commitments also play a factor in aiding you to reach toward you. Our long-term goals and ambitions. Series may provide subtle truths and awakenings now and in the weeks ahead. Pay attention to their messages and then analyze how you'd like to proceed with their insight. Your life is always evolving. Remember that. What should you do first? New ideas and downloads will come to you all day. You could pivot so many times during the last quarter moon in Gemini. On the one hand, this could be fantastic if you have multiple passion projects and musings to work on. On the other hand, you might not finish anything you start. It would be best to use this lunar energy to multitask your endeavors. Chipping away at your plans, projects, and more could help you feel productive as you manage your creative endeavors at work. Take a look at what matters most to you in the world. Somewhere on your list is probably a sense of well-being for all, and a safe community for our children to grow up in. One of the ways you can balance your own needs and the needs of the community is through participation in organic farming. Consider getting knowledgeable about the issues surrounding organic farming. Being aware of what you can do will add to your sense of well-being. Bye. Inorganic is a political statement as well as a nutritional one. You are going through some turbulence in your numerological chart these days. It would be good for you to keep your equilibrium while getting rid of certain ways of behaving. Be open to new ways of looking at things. If you aren't you could be overbearing today and provoke some tension in your family or with friends. To avoid any breakouts with those close to you, be conciliatory and everything will go for the best. As Pluto, the planet of change and transformation, moves into its final seven days in Aquarius, a friendly aspect with the moon as it joins Mars in a playful and creative part of your chart will boost your confidence. Pluto will be gone for only 11 weeks and when it returns, it will not only be back in direct motion but will also remain in Aquarius until 2044. In these final days before Pluto retrogrades out, its focus is on reflecting on the past and considering what you might want to change with hindsight. It is just as Mars, the planet of passion and the warrior planet of the cosmos moves into his final seven days in your romantic sector that the moon returns. This first visit since the asteroid Juno. Return to an adventurous part of your chart and the last before Venus, the planet of love returns in four days will see a sense of romance, passion and adventure rise over the coming days in a way that will give even the new working week a run for its money. Our eyes in the sky. Today's energy isn't just about tucking a euro, it's also about truly listening, observing, and soaking in the details that often go unnoticed. When you combine your sharp observations with your natural common sense, you become a master at evaluating all sides of any problem. It's as if you've got this internal compass guiding you through the twists and turns without needing much outside help. Have you ever found that when you take a moment to pause and reflect, the answers you're seeking seem to reveal themselves? Right now, you have that powerful ability within you. Trust it, lean into it and let your intuition guide you. 
This is your moment to assess, understand, and navigate through whatever challenges arise with grace and ease. And while your mind is active, don't forget to check in with your body, too. This is an excellent time to focus on your overall well-being. Your heightened awareness and sensitivity mean you're more in tune with your physical self, allowing you to quickly react to any health issues or signals your body might be sending. Have you been feeling the need for a bit more rest lately? Or maybe your body is craving some gentle movement to shake off the tension? Whether it's a few moments of mindfulness, a healthy meal, or just some quiet time, your body and mind are closely connected, and nurturing one will undoubtedly benefit the other. It's all about listening to yourself and responding with the care you deserve. As you move through your day, you might notice that those close to you are appreciating your calm composure, especially when dealing with complicated issues. Your self-confidence shines through, and it's this quiet assurance combined with your business-like approach that will help you settle any outstanding matters with poise. Don't hesitate to showcase your abilities, particularly to those in influential positions who might be watching. Sometimes, all it takes is a little confidence to shift the energy in your favor. Have you ever had one of those moments where you finally speak up, and suddenly, everything seems to fall into place? That's the kind of energy you're channeling today use it to your advantage. Feeling generous with your time and energy? You might find yourself naturally inclined to help others solve their problems, and right now, you're exceptionally good at it. Your ability to guide others through GH their challenges is something people are noticing and appreciating. But here's a gentle reminder, while it's wonderful to lend a helping hand, be mindful not to overextend yourself. Have you ever found yourself so caught up in supporting others that you neglected your own needs? It's easy to do, especially when you're feeling so capable and generous. But remember, it's all about balance. Don't let your kindness be taken for granted. Helping others is a beautiful thing, but not at the cost of your own well-being. During this introspective phase, you may find solace in engaging in physical activity, albeit a mild form. A leisurely walk, for instance, not only provides the exercise you might crave but also offers the chance to clear your mind and reconnect with your surroundings. This simple yet effective strategy can serve as a refreshing break, allowing you to gather your thoughts and return to your challenges with a renewed perspective and vigor. Remember, the key to navigating this period is a balanced approach, combining self-reflection with proactive steps to manage your energy and emotions constructively. As you engage with those around you today, be open to their ideas and opinions. Sometimes, the perspective of someone close to you can offer just the insight you need to move forward. Your mind is buzzing with energy, and others are noticing how quickly you're able to process information and complete tasks. This is a perfect time for collaboration. Including suggestions from those you trust could be exactly what you need to bring your projects to completion swiftly and successfully. Have you ever had that experience where someone's simple suggestion turns out to be the missing piece to your puzzle? That kind of collaborative magic is in the air today, so embrace it. But with all this mental activity, it's essential to stay mindful of how you're feeling. If you start to notice signs of restlessness or overwhelm, give yourself permission to take a break. A little downtime can do wonders for relaxing your mind and recharging your energy. Whether it's a quick walk outside to clear your head, a few moments of quiet reflection, or even some deep breaths to center yourself, finding what helps you unwind will bring balance back to your busy thoughts. It's all about recognizing when you need a pause, and then allowing yourself that space to refresh and refocus.